Yeah, it's not too bad for an underpowered scope. Final score was 372 out of a possible 400. So, yeah, not too bad for an underpowered scope. I couldn't even see the target. <laughs> All I could see is the orange bit with my scope. So, wasn't too bad for someone with no eyes. <laughs> Catch it. Yeah, good day, good day, good day. Out on the river again today. Haven't gone back to the creek yet. I've come back to get myself some more of this black sand. <laughs> oh, I didn't take enough home last time. But uh, what I did do with what I took home, and I only took home about, or oh, I suppose, that much in a bucket. And I soaked it for a week in about a cup of borax. Now you can put a bit of borax in it, or you can put a bit of lye, which is, I think uh, chemical name, sodium hydroxide, whatever. But uh, lye, I like borax because it's, you know, uh, lye is just drainer, uh, something like that, I think it is. But uh, you put either in it, let it soak for about a week, and then I, um, I tablespooned uh, into a pan and I panned that out and it was loaded with micron gold. So I've come back today and the uh, first thing I'm going to do, and it's an overcast day, about 22 degrees. Beautiful, actually beautiful. Uh, but I'm going to get myself some buckets of this black sand. A little bit of it's been moved around because I've had more rain here. But uh, I thought, why not? You know, it's... It's all micron gold, gold is gold. So uh, I just thought I'd gather it up, get a few buckets and take them home before I start the day. Uh, look at what I'm going to do. I bought my little rubber blow up boat today to carry my gear around in so uh, I might do a bit of that. I might go back to the creek. I'll see how it all pans out and I'll let you know. But for now I'm just loading up and I'll just show you. Um, I've got a bit of car problem too. She's overheating, losing water. And I just spent some money on it, getting it fixed, and they ain't fixed it. That really annoys me. But, um, yeah, so that's a worry. I might not be getting home. <laughs> Fingers crossed. But anyway, I'll just show you this black sand. It doesn't show it up real well on my camera. But here it is. Just all around there anyway there's a fair bit of it around but uh, it's just on the surface so uh, seemed a bit more concentrated last week when I was here so I missed out and because of that rain it's washed a lot of it down which was unfortunate I hope it still contains as much gold as the one I've got at home but um, anyway, I'll just get a bit of that, and uh, which I should have done last week. I said I was going to, and I didn't. Um, didn't get enough anyway. So uh, I'll see how the day progresses. So I'll get back to you, okay? One little speck. Just a little speck. Yes. One lousy little speck. Well, I'll keep going.
Oh, coroa fenda. Almost made it to the river. There she is. <laughs> the old car. Oh, a lot worse for wear now, though. A lot worse for wear. Nearly completely buried. Ah, oh, there. Well, she's gone for good now. Now this is where the washout come through, right round here. Have a go at that. And that's where the old car come out of, up there. And that's on the other side of the road, way up. So she come down through a fence, there's a fence across here. I don't know how it got through the fence, but uh, anyway, there she is, buried upside down. <laughs> Look at this black sand here. Whoa. Lovely. Oh. oh, there's tons of it here. I didn't come here, I got mine from another spot. But have a look at it. Whoa. Oh, I'd love to get some of this. It's everywhere. It's everywhere. All through here. Right up here. Here. <laughs> There's a nice big heap of it right there. Wow. Oh well, I've probably got enough for now. So I don't think I'll bother coming down here with the shovel and bucket to get any more. But boy, that's nice. It's actually better than where I got the other stuff. A lot more of it, a lot thicker. Anyway, move along and I'll get back to you. Yeah, a few pieces there. A couple little bits. Not a lot. That's a start. I'll keep going. A couple more bits. One there, one there, one there. Not real big. I'm just working this spot along here. There's a little waterfall coming out of there. I'll try and get that rock out if I can. I'll get back there. pieces, the nice bits, yeah, that's out of that little crevice, I'll keep going, a few more, same crevice, getting a bit out of there, I'll keep going. Yeah, there's an example of one of those bedrock caps that I was talking about, it's a cap on top that's peeled off. That rock there would probably weigh a thousand pounds or more. And the only way you'd lift it would probably be to drill it and blow it to bits. To get under that. It'd be nice to get under that actually. <laughs> but I haven't got a, a backhoe. Alright, keep going. Yeah, here's another one here. This one. It's the top cap. That one there, it's got a bit of gravel and stuff under it. And another one here. That one. It's starting to come off all the way along there. Yeah, so that's what happens on this bedrock. Yeah, it's still a bit rough to deal with going out in there. It tends to want to wash you away. So it's just running a bit fast, unfortunately. I got me a little boat. So 
so I can get over the other side there. But uh, yeah, it might sweep me away <laughs> with my <me> boat. <laughs> but anyway, I'll keep battling on. Got a little bit of gold, but not much. Not much. So the river's still a bit too high. Okay, I'll get back here. It's a deep little hole there. I'm not saying there's any gold down in that, but you wouldn't get out of there without the Huntley spoon. It's a deep little pocket. Right down deep there. Yeah, well that's it for the day. Not a lot of gold. Didn't get a whole lot. Yeah. Yeah, not much. Not much there today. But anyway, a bit of colour. I had a lot of fun. Did a lot of different things. <laughs> got me black sand, so I'll have to work on that. I've got two buckets. And uh, had a bit of a swim. Been a nice, sort of overcast, cool day bit humid but um, all in all fairly cool so anyway I'd just like to say thanks for coming along for the ride and if you think of it please give it a thumbs up or well, if you want to you can give it a thumbs down if you like <laughs> doesn't bother me either way but I had a good time that was the main thing and uh, yeah so uh, thanks for coming along for the ride and I'll catch you on the next one. Okay? Bye.